Okay, this is Fred Eberly from Toshiba Business Solutions, and thanks for taking a minute to have a look at uh, this video. Wanted to show you briefly what it looks like to do repair order storing for things like the auto industry um, in a very quick fashion if you have barcode capability on your forms. So what I have for you is a simple um, repair order form that I just mocked up here, putting the client name in at their address, year, make, and VIN number model VIN number of the car, um, other pertinent information would be the reference number for the repair order, the date, there's also a part number here we're grabbing. So uh, again, this is just a, a demo sample and in here you'll see that there's multiple documents behind it. I just threw some other things in there to be able to uh, show you what it looks like when we're bursting a document based on a QR code but we're still bypassing all the normal barcodes that might be on some other things. So there's four total documents in here that have re that are the repair orders. So you should see once we put all this in that it should break those apart and you'll have the backup documentation behind each one. Um, so, and what we're doing is we are simply using a watch folder here so if you're scanning from a scanner or a multifunction device, whatever the case would be, you can simply land the document in here. The document management system will grab it and begin to process it. And what we're showing you here is DocuWare, which is one of the ones Toshiba is tied in with, a great partner of ours that does a lot of fantastic doc management capability from capture to storage to workflow. Uh, in this case, we're just showing real basic capabilities of storage with pulling data out of the barcode. So we've got five different bits of information embedded in that little QR code and you'll see as it populates it will begin to uh, fill in the data here. Right now there's nothing in the file cabinet and if I refresh you'll start to see some of this stuff coming in and you're seeing that I've got customer names, repair orders, VIN numbers, all that kind of information peeled out of the barcode and into my index fields, which makes it very accurate. Um, I can also look on the right side. I've got a viewer over here that shows me the document. And you'll see this one has 15 pages because that had all the supporting material behind it. So if I look at the thumbnails, I'm sorry, it's running a little slow here on my computer today, but uh, you'll see all those thumbnails sitting there. And I can pick any of those to look at, or I can cycle to another document and uh, this one is only one of the one-pagers. Um, I can also flip it through this way. Another one-pager. And uh, here we've got a three-pager. So real simple way to be able to have your people who are maybe not technical be able to go to a device, hit a button, take all their paperwork, store it in there, and utilize this little piece of information to fill out everything I need to store that in the file cabinet. The really cool part is, for one, I didn't have to key anything in. And for two, all this data can be linked to other databases. So if you work within another application, which you most likely do, I can create a little button in that application that when you click it, it might look up the VIN number or whatever piece of information you're looking at on that file. Uh, so real quick and easy, very cool uh, technology that's here to be able to utilize um, your staff at their level without having to get too technical on them, but be able to tie it into all your systems. So if you have any questions, feel free to reach back to me. Again, it's Fred Everly at Toshiba Business Solutions. Happy to help you any way we can.